So then I'll just take it and I'll just flip it like that. And you'll see. Ooh, looks just like a pancake. Good morning, friends. It is Sunday, and you guys saw Edwina and I last night. <laughs> I'm still recovering, still recovering. I think the makeup is actually causing some sort of like reaction on my face, to um, say the least. And I'm exhausted. But if you can hear, my aunt is here, and she's here to give us an update. And I'm very excited because I need to start getting back on track, and I need to bust out my journal because. Last night, I had a glass of wine, as you guys saw, or a mini bottle, if you would say. And I ate some cheese, some rice cakes and peanut butter. Um, yeah, it was it was all over the place. So Basically, you blew it. Blew it. <laughs> no. <laughs> um, it's taken me two years to get to this point. I, I'm allowed to blow it, but I, I need to get... This just needs to get back on track so hopefully her journey will inspire me back to whatever it was that I was doing but um she has her journal and I see some stars so lots of stars actually <clears throat> so tell me how was your week you know the week before remember I hadn't prepared all my meals and yes. it was a little sketchy and since I've only been <laughs> so, so sketchy <laughs> so since I've only been doing this for three weeks I did much better this week because I'm still not completely organized. Organized. I am now almost got it down to a science. I know exactly what I like. My little egg muffins, by the way, yes. turned out the best that I've ever... They oh, were, and they'll keep getting better. Oh, well, they were delicious. And they're always good a little burned. Yes. Yeah. Well, I figured out that if, if you don't put spinach or anything in the bottom of the... I like to have the spinach because it creates yeah. like a cup. Okay. And it burns. And it's that, really but but the, the, the egg white burns better if it touches the, the pan first and then you put your... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It doesn't matter if it's like underneath. I'm just picky, I guess. I don't know. Anyways, so what I did, I did do, I, I, I had a couple and I, because I wrote down so that I wouldn't have to rewrite everything I eat every day. I wrote down the exact way that I prepare my meals on my little journal thingy. Oh, very good. So then when I say meal one, it's exactly what I had. So I don't, because I'm following no, it and to this, the T. I remember this week we wrote down exactly. Exactly. So what I did is every day, um, instead of, you know, I because I didn't have bananas. And so what I did is I wrote what fruit I had or which protein I had based on, you very know. Very good. Just to kind of, and it really helped. I found that I was writing every day at the end of the day, and I wanted to because it's motivating. it was motivating. So, um, and it's amazing, you know, the, the, the egg muffin tray, one egg muffin is a third cup of... Uh, yeah, I know. Yeah. So, so you get two egg muffins. Yes. <laughs> it was... Well, I, Did the light bulb go off? <laughs> You're like, oh, that's why I eat two of them. The light bulb went off. Yeah. But I did use, what I did is because I couldn't just eat egg whites. Um, and I didn't put the spinach in there this time. I put uh, a few specks of um, yellow pepper. Yeah. And a few specks of yeah. onion. I put, yeah. And it was perfect. You know, that. That was Samson. <laughs> Samson. <laughs> so I did, it was it was fabulous all week. Um, I, I, I got on the elliptical. Oh, you did? 16 minutes on Tuesday. Whoa. That included... Uh, uh, about a minute and a half, you know, just pause. Yeah. You know, so I could breathe. And because after about eight minutes, I could no longer okay. breathe. And um, so I stayed on there for 16 minutes on Tuesday. That's awesome. And then I repeated it on Thursday. Oh, okay. So I was, you know, and no wine, no, the tea. Did it help you? I came home every night, had tea. It's like something to do. It was something to do. And then it turns out that you do enjoy it. It and does then you, calm you down. And, right. And then you realize, was I an alcoholic really or not? Yeah. I don't know. Well, did you guys see me and Amina <laughs> last night in the seven <laughs> I was like, the, <laughs> the thing is, is like there is being an alcoholic is serious. Yes. But when you when you drink wine, you know, every day because it tastes good, whatever. What happens is, is you're drinking it every day for like a year and then you're like, whoa, 
I drink a lot of wine. I, I, you know, and it's only like a glass or two a night, but you're But thinking, we're in business too. Like right. you go to a happy hour, you have a meeting. Exactly. And everybody's like, oh, why don't you have a glass of wine? Right. And then when you're not drinking wine, then you're like, whoa, everybody drinks a lot of wine. It's a social yeah. event. So is eating. Um, and so, but I, I know you said not to, but I can't help it because I'm just. Not to what? Well, I weigh myself every morning because that's what I always do. And you know what? It is what It's it fine. Is. Listen, you're not, I, I'm not going to change your ways. No, we're, I, we're, just, we're not spring chickens anymore. I have to get the on the thing The thing is, is, I just want to make sure it doesn't mess with your mind. Oh, no, no, it doesn't. It for does, some people, it will, it, it deters. I know sometimes for me, yeah. it causes a problem because it, it also the reverse. If I've lost weight, you know oh. what it does? Oh, well, I can have a little extra peanut butter. Like in my mind, oh, I'm doing really well. Oh, no. I can skip doing the elliptical today. So you you gotta remember, we're our minds are very powerful. Well, this morning. <laughs> but look I, at all these stars. Oh yeah, there's all stars everywhere. And it, it's. Did you enjoy putting the star? You did, didn't yes, you? I did. <laughs> you were laughing at me when I gave you the stars. You're like, well, I'm not gonna use stickers. Well, wait. So Haley saw them. <laughs> oh gosh. My eight year old granddaughter going on twelve, and she says. Eliane, what are, what are the stars for? <laughs> so I told her, and she says, well, you need to have more. So she Well, you better has, do better. Well, she has stars at home. She's going oh. to bring me. Cause, oh. Because you know, she's all that with right. a bag of chips. And, you know, right. And she has stars. She says, I'll bring you some different stars that have things that... Anyway, so she got all carried away. But look at how much I weighed this morning. Well. Well, you don't have to, you know, look. I mean, seriously. Okay, well, have, we'll go back to the stats, but this is very exciting. But I haven't been that in, I don't know. Okay, so forever. so remember the stars, what did the stars mean again? Oh, uh, this was no wine, no wine, no wine, no wine, no wine. And then the red was uh, all the food. Okay, so you were spot on oh, there. Oh, I'm sorry, the, the red was the wine, no wine. The, the purple was all the food. This is was working out because I did 16 minutes. That's great. Yeah. You did cardio again? Mm-hmm. Saturday? Yeah, yesterday morning. It was only about eight minutes. Cause That's I just, fine. I mean, remember. I did mostly walking, but it's okay. I moved. You moved. Ten minutes. This is you moved. And I sweat. Yeah. And so yeah. It, 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 it. That's good. I feel that I'm able to stay on a little bit longer. and I Every time you'll stay on longer. Well, I'm getting stronger in my legs because of my surgery. So. Okay. So, all right. So I'm really happy with that. Now let's go back to the food. Um, let's talk about each meal. Because I, at first I thought it was redundant. Like, oh, I'm writing all this stuff down. I keep writing what I'm eating. I'm eating the same thing every day. The thing is, is though, I wasn't in any pain and I was really energetic all week. What did I eat? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. So you start to learn, like, you know, how your body reacts to things. Like, you know, when you eat cheese, Jeez. you sound like this. I don't know why. I'm, and you drink wine and this is how you sound. And you're tired and you're puffy. Lactose intolerant. Yeah. <laughs> and red wine, it was like red burning. Mm -hmm. Because you haven't been. I'm old. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> so let's talk about the food. Okay, the food. breakfast. Any problems with breakfast? None. And I find that I really like the berries because they lend moisture to the oatmeal. I love berries. Yeah, I'm so, addicted. Okay. And I, you know, and I, and I've got the ones from Costco. So now there's raspberries, uh, blackberries, and blueberries. And I love the, the frozen. Yes. Better than fresh. Well, it's the best because you get them out, throw them in. They're perfect. And you don't have to do anything with them no. because the oatmeal warms them up. Um, so the two rice cakes. Um, I used to only have, you know, you told me two tablespoons. Right, because you had more fat later in the day. Right. So now, I, and I find that if I just put a little bit on each. Rice cake, it works, and it, it works out to about a um, tablespoon per rice cake. But remember, yes, I know the fat is what helps you burn fat. Right. So I I do eat my. Chicken. You may be losing weight, but remember we want to burn fat. Well, I'm definitely using the whole the full two tablespoons because I you know, and I'm doing the you know not so much a, a whole. Sometimes it's you know just a handful of berries. I mean, okay. I'm I'm just taking them with. That's fine. But I'm leaving them at work, which is working out better. And then for my meal, my third meal, my, I guess sort of my lunch, um, I've been eating the tuna. Okay, yeah. And the whole can is like six point something, so I just, I cut it in, you know. To have four ounces, in, yeah. yeah. And, um, and what I'm finding is it, it's working because I, you know. I used to love mixing my tuna with my rice. Right. It was actually really good. And that's, and that's what I'm doing. And the salsa. So, mm-hmm. Uh, I didn't have tortillas. I just had the rice. Okay, really so you just did the rice. rice. Yeah. 
I did a half. You'll go rice. through phases where, and then you won't even want to look at the rice. As far as the veggies, I just stuck to because I had the frozen broccoli and the yep. frozen green beans. Yep. Uh, those green beans are really good. They're delicious. At Costco. Delicious. Um, and what else do I have? Oh, the Brussels sprouts. I ate some of those as one of my veggies. But then uh, this one, the ground turkey, um, I made the ground turkey kind of like, I made the put in the space, same spices I put in kiftas and yeah. the meatballs. And they're delicious. Yep. Uh, but you know what? I don't have another muffin pan, so I have the mini muffin pans. So I put smaller meatballs. Oh, that's cute. That's a good idea. Because they cooked not quite as long and it made them not quite as dry because they're a little bit smaller. smaller. Yeah. So instead of having two big mm -hmm. ones, I just have to And you know what I started ones. doing? I stopped making the little hamburgers and I just made it like taco meat. Exactly. So you can do that too. And then at dinner, sometimes you could throw those into like veggies and you make like a saute. That's, I think that's what I was thinking Maybe about this week. You could this do. week. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I stuck to the program. And you just add a little water, like you're making taco meat. Mm -hmm. And even, you know, like Friday night we were somewhere. I don't know where we went. I took my, I took my food. <gasps> you did. I found my, I was like, oh my God, I've turned into Shana. <laughs> <laughs> I took my food. Where'd you go? Um... We were just over at Bob's, just, you know, but oh, they okay. all had sausage and, you know. But you don't know. It's like you almost go, you know what, my stomach, my plan. It's like, I it's did, not that there's anything wrong with their food. The problem is people think that you're trying to tell them that there's something wrong with their food. There's nothing wrong. And you, were, I didn't even want it. It yeah. smelled good. Yeah. And just smelling it, you know. It was, right now it was your okay. food should be good. It, it you should good. enjoy it. So I have been sticking to the... Lettuce and I like the uh, your salad. My salad. My salad is amazing. And I the uh, apple cider. Oh yeah, you just put a little bit with mm -hmm. your dressing. I did. And then as far as the veggie, I just you know. And you're right, uh, because I was having chicken, you know, because I'm having tuna. Uh, my fifth meal, I was having definitely. I heated up the chicken and the veggie, which was kind of like a whole meal with the salad. With a side salad. Now, the cabbage, you're right. That added a lot of texture. Wasn't that good? And crunch. I got to do that again. From Trader Joe's. Yeah. I had that all week. It's delicious. It's delicious. That and the, uh, the it's, arugula. Um, it's a whole thing of, oh, the arugula. It's like you added steak to your meal or something. Exactly. It's, it's it, got a great flavor. The texture was yeah, perfect. so good. Uh, so I had a better time this week with this meal than it, just it, lettuce. And it was the added stuff from Trader Joe's. Mm -hmm. That's why it's so hard to go to just one grocery store because every store has like something. That... But I just bought a little bag and it lasted me all week because it was perfect. Yeah. You know, just put a little bit, and it, you're right. It's kind of like a Chinese chicken salad without. Yes. Because I'm in love with that salad at Albertsons, oh. but you know. Oh my God. And I go to Albertsons and get that Chinese, like uh. it's already pre-made. <laughs> I'm like, that's like my cheat meal. Adam's like, don't you want like something exciting? I'm like, this is exciting. It's Chinese well, chicken salad. And then Friday night, you know, so I had my tea because I I came home and oh, I. Oh yeah, how I, were the tea? Which one was your favorite? The green tea was amazing, uh, but the chamomile tea is amazing. It has a really good oh, taste. Oh, is it? I want to, maybe I should get that one. Trader you Joe's should. has a good it, tea. It has. But Friday, so we're there for dinner. I have my food, and they all pop out a glass of wine, and I put my water in my wine glass, and I drank it. <laughs> yeah, you kind of have to. Well, that's kind of how I quit smoking. It was just, you know, so it's mind over matter. So they're all drinking wine. I'm drinking my water, and it was okay. I was fine with it. I was like, you know, this isn't, it's just the idea that it's a social thing. Yes. You, you have to break your. But you said you had a glass of wine yesterday. Yeah. Last night I couldn't help it because we were, I don't know. <laughs> I guess it was Saturday night. We were no, just, it's okay. But it was, uh, so maybe Saturday night's your cheat or your treat night. I, it must be, I don't know, because that's. We what did you, eat. did you have your treat meal yesterday? No, I, I had all my regular okay. food. I just had a glass so of today wine. So today you're going to. Today, no, it's Monday. Monday night is my... Oh, night. that's right. Okay. And so last week, this is really funny because, you know, I was thinking, okay, my, last Monday night was my free night. You know, I'm going to have a... We had... Your dad came and we... Uh, to Bob's dinners because he has Monday night dinner. So we had it at the park where we live. We have like... He built this whole park or whatever. So everybody had burgers and dogs. We were going to keep it kind of like American theme. They had macaroni salad and whatever. I found myself having a burger with nothing on it, just jalapenos. And um, I met, we met, they made corn on the cob. And so I had that couple handful of corn. And that was delicious. And it was my treat meal. Oh. And, and, yeah. and, 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 and it was... Well, you're, like I said, your treat meals actually look like regular food. Right. For people who are like, what, what, how is this a treat? And you're like, because it's not what I normally eat. Because it's not what I normally eat. And it was delicious. There's a little more sugar, a little yes. more salt. 
Yeah. And it, but it was still, you know, and don't you want the bun? I'm like, I, not no, really. not so much. <laughs> <laughs> I just want, I wanted the meat. Yeah. With the jalapenos because it was beef and it was. Oh, nice. Yeah. So, okay. So very nice. I think I did much better last week. No, this is, you, you seem more in control. Yes. And that's probably why you feel better. Mm -hmm. Oh, and Jim thinks that. I feel better. He also said, he, he, he told me. <laughs> this everyone, is the most important part. I know. He said, well, she's in a better mood. <laughs> and, and I didn't, I don't know. I, <laughs> You're like, oh, <laughs> I'm not as grumpy. <laughs> <laughs> Why is that? Um, it's because you feel like you took control of something. We're like, oh. I mean, we're obviously family. So for me, I'll speak for myself. I feel like when I'm in control, like I, the whole week, your energy you, you My energy feel level good. is much higher. You get better sleep. Mm -hmm. You're you deal with stress better. I slept until nine a.m. yesterday morning. You're feeding yourself the things that give you all those things. Right. You feel better. You're happy. They're mood. It's a mood enhancer. We think that our mood gets better when we drink wine and we eat bread. Mm -hmm. That actually is not true. No. I mean, for a minute, it does make you feel happier. <laughs> but no. But the next morning, in the long I, run, I did. You know, I didn't take the. That's fish good. So Jim said that. Oh yeah, and Jim, um, um, he didn't drink either all week. He didn't have any beers. He doesn't drink wine. You'll be a good beer. influence on him. Yes. Wait, and what so, did you say about fish? Uh, I didn't have the, I forgot to take my fish oil supplements, but whatever. That's important. I know. Because they're fatty acids. They're and there. They, I don't know why I didn't take them. It's okay, I've been slacking pills. on my uh, own. Yeah. I take my other vitamins I, because I take that along with my pills every morning because I have to but um so my goal is because you know November 5th I go back to the cardiologist because I went because you can't go you know you have to go at least once a year to see a cardiologist so that he can give you more pills and I only take a baby high blood pressure pill because he says I'm going to treat it with a feather instead of a fly swatter my condition and it works but I'm back on the 5th I'm supposed to have my whole blood work panel done so that when I go back on the 5th, that's how we do it, right? Well, I got weighed when I went last time, which was uh, September 22nd or something. And I've been on this since then. So I'm look, I, ha I haven't taken the blood test yet because I'm waiting until like, you know, maybe Monday or Tuesday or Wednesday. Go get my blood work so that he can read it for the 5th. I just want to see. So that'll be interesting. I, it really will be because... He's been trying to get me to do this for, I don't know. Since Five since. years? Yeah. So um, I, I'm kind of interested to, to see what happens with my blood work. And, uh, so, yeah, I mean, it, it takes time. Things don't just show up right away. But Yeah, but I was in such... Yeah. It, yeah, I mean, you've already, like, it's like a 360. Oh, yeah. And what about weight? I mean, it's, it's hard. The doctor's office is, like, I'm always, like, 10 pounds heavier at the doctor's office. It's like the, their scale is very different. So it'll just depend. But what did you weigh when you were? When I was there, uh, it was one. Well, it was before I started, so it was like one eighty-seven. And then, you know, when I first started, I was at one eighty-three. And then week one, on the fifth of October, when I was here, it was one seventy-nine point six. And then, we we didn't do anything the week after that. So then last week. I know I weighed the same, but that was because doesn't I had matter. Had did you did, and all that do you remember the measurements? Yes. And so <laughs> it doesn't matter about the food. It's like every week, it the weight doesn't I'm not matter. Gaining weight. Right. That and that's the that's the idea. Well, you can see where it's you know I'm going from the 180s consistent down to the 179 consistent down to the 178 consistent. Remember every week half a pound to a pound. I, I know this more. Look, Look where I was this morning. 176. Was it? I mean, I know it's not yeah, but it's big for me because, you know, whatever. Everything's big. Mm -hmm. But here's why. It's not just the weight because now my clothes are fitting different. Now, and now I have to go through my, you know, all my clothes because I have clothes of every size, basically. So I'm noticing that my clothes are fitting different. And that is huge. Well, it's because you're changing your body shape, mm -hmm. too. It's not just... Well, yeah, because, and, and I'm not, you know... Um, plus, so, I'm, the sodium... Oh, that's huge. And the sugar... Yes. And the addition of the water and the removal of the fat... Um, <laughs> it's completely changed yeah. everything. I mean, it's weird. It's really strange. So, does Jim notice, too, when he sees you? Oh, yeah. Well, he noticed it because he's... I, he literally... He's not even trying to lose weight. He's just, by default, he's just like... 
And has he told you he's seen you change? Oh yeah, everybody has. Oh, every you got you tried. Everybody. So you know they say it takes four weeks for you to notice it. Mm -hmm. It takes six weeks for everyone else to notice it, no, and it takes already... twelve weeks for it to be done. Uh, yeah, it, it everybody at work. Are you do? Are you losing weight? <laughs> it's just, and I'm not even you know. Going crazy. I'm not. Imagine if you were going crazy. Okay, well, they see me walking back and forth to the kitchen five <laughs> times a day. So they're like, how are you losing weight and eating so much? That's what the, the, what, the one girl. People always say, they're like, you're always eating. That's exactly what she said. She says, you're like, eating that's how you lose all weight. day long. I said, <laughs> it's I'm the eating. best diet ever. <laughs> I said, every three hours. She goes, what do you mean every three hours? I know, people are like... And so, and I it. haven't said anything to anybody because you don't want to push it because you know, nobody believes in it or whatever. No. So, and they all have their own ideas. I showed it. her my calendar. Oh, you did? And I said, this is all I'm doing. She said, I don't even need that much. I only eat one-fifth. I said, but you don't need. <laughs> all right, we just, we just measured her. And wait. What are the results? Okay, so in my weight, I'm down 1.4 pounds. I know the point four is. That's awesome. But that's important probably, to me. Yeah. But anyways, um, and then the measurements, I went down two more inches of my waist. Oh my goodness. And one inch of my hips. I mean, that's amazing, right? No, your hips don't lie. I mean, they're not they lying. Don't. They're telling they're the not. truth. I'm dancing to Shakira on her birthday. <laughs> She's dancing to Shakira on her birthday. <laughs> that's what I'm doing. But isn't that great? That is, uh, it I'm is great. You know what that, you need a gold star. star. You need a gold star. Haley. <laughs> gold star. There it is, folks. There it is, folks. She did I'm it. Excited. I'm excited. I'm actually really excited. This is very good. And it was it was a lot easier this week. Um, it's just getting a organized. Bit easier. I'm organized for sure. And um, I'm excited for this coming week. Can't yeah. wait to wake up in the morning and have oatmeal. All right. So let's um Thank let's God write like your oatmeal. diet for the week real quick, and then yeah. we'll go. Okay. I just wrote down what you told me. And what? I just kept, oh, the calories. Okay. I just kept reading, you know. What did you say? Totally motivated and re-inspired. Pictures again. No wine. Drink water. Drink tea. Elliptical 15 minutes. That's all I wrote. I was just, you know, I don't know. So what did you write on Friday? What is that? Just the week was good. Goals met on the elliptical. Surpassed. Uh, did much better by having the food prepared. I weighed 176 this morning. I wrote that today. Wow, that feels great. Oh. Oh, that's very nice. Yeah. I, 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 that was, you know, was, I don't know. I just didn't write anything else all week. But. Okay. And yeah. We were just talking about her day. Um, cause for me, like say dinner is at eight, right? But I wait until nine or I'm like off my time. Then I'm totally messed up and I'm starving randomly. So you got to eat your meal, but so you didn't find yourself hungry at all. How's your hunger at all during the day? Uh, hunger is fine. Okay. I, I, I just, like I said last week, I, I don't really think about it as much as I did the first and second week. Okay. And now perfect. I just know when my body tells me I'm hungry. Okay. Frying pan with a couple squirts of that coconut oil spray. It's delicious. It's yeah. It's delicious. The eggplant. And I, you just keep smashing it. You yeah. Know, and then it gets darker and darker and darker until yes. it gets grilled. You have to have patience. There's no oil, no it's salt, delicious. nothing. Yeah. And it was delicious. Um, so I use that at night. I put it in my salad. You know, I just cut it up as a veggie. Um, so on one day, on one of those days, I didn't eat. Do you have, uh, uh, apple cider? Yeah. Yeah. Can you use that for dressing and stuff? Yep. Go take the dog for a walk. Yeah. So That's three times, 15 minutes on the elliptical, and then um, walk. one walk for 30 minutes. Um, if you can do that, then we won't have, we don't touch the diet at this point because okay. you're getting everything you need. Make sure you get the two tablespoons of peanut butter because that's what's going to help drop your body fat. Um, I've got two tablespoons of peanut butter. I've got my uh, tablespoon of uh, olive oil at night. At night. Um, How much fat? What? Okay, between the between this and this. So if I'm spraying. Look who's loving the, the Keurig. There's enough water in there, so you're good. Do I have to... I don't want to dump this. Would that be too much? Well, you can do a smaller cup. Oh. But then it'll be stronger. Oh, good. Okay. So if you do, like, the smallest one. Why? Because you're halfway full. It's going to overflow. Watch. Now it's going to overflow. You're going to ruin the whole thing. It is not going to overflow. But just in case. Anyway, so I buy inspirational mugs so that it gets me excited. See, this one is inspirational. You see how it's inspirational? 
Well, that is so true. <laughs> well, no, it's like we don't do things because we think we're going to fail. So what would you do if you didn't think you could? Well, I'd be doing a lot. <laughs> I, I, yeah, I can me too. tell you that. It's... Uh... Oh, see, perfect. Because any more, it would have... It would just makes it like a nice little shot. Probably, it's probably strong, yeah. Yes! And then, see, I used this one today. Which one? She is Superwoman. Wonder, Wonder Woman. Wonder Woman. She is. She really is. Except not, <laughs> not this weekend. So... Okay, so let's make... Oh, so... So seriously, I need to know what's wrong with your... Uh, Microwave. Oh, I think it's just fuse. It's a fuse and we need to fix it. That's the problem. Anyways, we're gonna make a protein pancake and I was gonna show my aunt how to do it. This time we're gonna use zucchini because I don't have any spinach, but zucchini is also really good. It's like zucchini bread is what it ends up. Oh, he did buy spinach, but you know what? It, that needs to be used. We'll use zucchini because that's, yeah. And then egg whites and then my I stevia. I thought I forgot to buy, I forgot to buy egg whites. Um, I went to the store. I we need the chicken. Store. I, I mean, so. I was at the store. I was there. Okay, so we're going to show you. It's a really expensive gift we got. The problem is, is I'm, I don't really use a microwave. Um, but what it is, is um, Adam's brother's wife got it for us. And it's amazing. It's just that I don't use... First of all, our microwave is broken. But look, it's um, it's basically showing you how to cook things in the microwave. But like for you and not necessarily maybe you, but even Jim, like you can put your veggies, you can put all your stuff in there and it cooks it in the microwave, like steams it. Wow. Right? Well, that so, would be good. Yeah. Yeah. Look, so like you can put all your veggies or whatever. And I mean, you're going to correctly and it, it'll make them a little bit better. I mean, I don't advise using a microwave to do all this, but look, it has all these recipes that you can like do in the well, microwave. I have a convection microwave, so it actually would work really well. Probably, actually. Yeah. Anyways, it's a really nice, and I didn't want to give it away. Like, I wanted it to be used, you know? I will use it. I think it's just a really nice thing. So there you go. A, Look at that. And I think it's like German or something. It's a really cool thing. It I is. just probably not going to use it. Oh, and there's a website. I can just yeah. log on and... A protein pancake is you get a pan. I like this size. Yeah, that's the right um, size. It's a good size. And then I turn it on like five or six, like pretty high. And then I get my coconut oil. I get this one from Trader Joe's. I, I like the one from Trader Joe's better, but you can get it at the grocery store. And then I just spray it. And then I let it get hot while I prepare the stuff. So you've got egg whites, you've got oats, and then you've got some zucchini. So I'm gonna get that ready. Okay, so you're gonna put two third cup of oats. I mean, of egg whites. Can you guys tell I haven't had breakfast? I keep saying the wrong words for wrong things. Very nicely done. It's usually the whole thing because I use it up exactly. Yep. Okay. So, and then I need another. So then a third cup of oats. I like the coach's oats, but for some reason for the protein pancake, these oats seem to work a little bit better because they mix better. Oops. Fill it up. No, you want a little bit more. She's like, give me my third cup. I want my full third cup. Okay, we're good. Very good. Now what? Now, um, normally um, I usually just take a handful of spinach and I stuff it in there. But we're going to do zucchini. And let me get a knife. So, so I want you to just cut up about half of that. So, no, you know how you can just chop it, yeah. Careful, oh my god, it's sharp. Okay. And then, yeah, you can just slice it in half and then just throw it in there. Like this? Yep. Okay. And then take the stevia. I do about a, a vial of it. Just almost out. Yep, the whole thing. Okay. More? No, that's good. And then um, I put... I need to get cinnamon. Cinnamon. That comes out really a lot, so. <laughs> okay. And then when I do the zucchini, I really like to use the pumpkin spice. 
Yeah. And sometimes I'll put nutmeg, but I'm just going to do pumpkin spice today. Is that enough? It's funny. She's going like this. I'll show you guys how I usually do it. <laughs> okay. And then that is good. So then I close it up. And meanwhile, the pan is getting really hot. Got to turn that on. Lock it in. Oh, so that means it's not closed all the way. So turn it back over. Nope. It's not closed. You got to... Oh. Yeah. It won't let undo it. It is closed. It it has to be like all the way. There you go. Okay. Okay. Let me let me do it. it was okay. Operator. So then I just do the single serve and I just get it to where it's totally Oh, you got to lock it in. There we go. It's very powerful, the ninja. So that should be good. Then I take it out. Okay. Is that hot enough? It looks yep. And then when you put it on, it's almost like it's like gonna sizzle, basically. And then just pour it all in the pan. There we go. Perfect. When you hear that, that means the pan was perfect. If the pan is not warm enough, you're gonna get like soggy pancake and it's gonna take forever and then it's not gonna cook. I will say this though, the zucchini pancake does take a little bit longer to cook, so I don't keep it high the whole time. I put it a little bit down. The but spinach it, cooks faster, the zucchini takes like a little bit. Seal brown and then... Yeah. So there you have it folks. So we'll come back in about like two or three minutes and it should be done. And we'll turn it over. I mean I'm just saying. Yeah. I'm not gonna say that. <laughs> so anyways, what I was saying was I noticed that the edges, it looks like it's yeah, it's you know, dry now. It's drying. So the center's still wet, so then I'll just take it and I'll just flip it like that. And you'll see. Ooh, looks just like a pancake. So then I let it cook. But again, the zucchini, it takes a little bit longer. And even so, I'll probably take it off and it'll probably still not be all the but way But look, cooked, but... it's on low heat. Yeah, it's on like four. Yeah. Out, of, low heat. out of six. Which is good. Or... Right. Yeah. All right, guys, so here's the protein pancake. It turned out really good, as you can see. It's a little moist still inside because what happens with the um, zucchini, it just takes a little bit longer. But um, let me taste it. Yeah. Good. So it is 5.38. I have not um, picked up the camera since my aunt left. We went to Trader Joe's. Got some stuff, and um, I just got done with some pictures for my blog. Um, I told you guys I was trying to uh, take more pictures, so... Anyways, I was just watching... He's just not that into you. I love this movie. Um, I got such a really, like, just a really cute little card from Howard Hughes. Um, the ones who uh, opened up and built uh, downtown Summerlin. So they sent me this um, little note. It just says, Shana, thank you for all your coverage of downtown Summerlin, Kimberly. And it looks like she's the general manager of Howard Hughes. And they gave me a $25 gift card to Crave, which is a new um, sushi bar and restaurant that's there. So I'm excited about that. So we might go, we might go there. Uh, probably not tonight, but sometime. Um, anyways, yeah, so that's just what I'm doing. I've been really, like, just trying to relax today. Um, I'm going to upload a new vlog right now, and, um, we have a new video coming out on Thrifters Anonymous tomorrow. And then our t-shirts are almost done, and I was going to show you guys kind of like a sneak preview because no one has seen the design yet. And I'm wondering, they might already be out by the time you guys see this vlog, so I think it's fine if I show you. Anyways, I've been trying to uh, play around. We're going to do a campaign since... 
we just don't have any money right now to buy shirts and stuff, but this is the design here. Let me show you. Let's see if it'll focus. So there's the design. And I, I love it. Um, we're probably going to do some t-shirts, um, some tank tops, a couple of racerback tanks, a uh, regular t-shirt. I think we're going to do a hoodie. So it'll be on represent and I'll, um, I'll have the link up and I'll let you guys know when it comes out and I'm excited. Um, I want like every single one of them. So, um, yeah, that's just really exciting. So anyways, that's what's going on. I still have to cook my food, but I don't really feel like it right now. So I'll do that a little bit later. But anyways, I will talk to you guys later. Bye. -bye.